So we are in Nakuru town and Vincent told me there's something called a bicycle taxi. How bicycle, does that work? Bicycle taxi <laughs> is just like from short distances, maybe to a kilometer. Uh, not beyond a kilometer, maybe a kilometer, two kilometers and they'll charge like something like a quarter dollar. So what happens is I know about uh, motorcycle taxis. You can get on the back of someone's motorcycle, but apparently you can also get on the back of someone's bike. Yeah. You pay them and they cycle you to somewhere you need to go. Yes, it's amazing. It this happens. is crazy. I told you town it happens. Does it also happen in Nairobi? Ah, no, no, no. In Nairobi, no. So that is a taxi? Yeah, a taxi. My name is Michael. After traveling to over 40 countries, 2021 has been a turning point. This year, a short notice career break gave me the opportunity to jump on a last minute flight to a childhood dream of mine, Africa. As a kid, I used to be a big animal nerd, spending evenings watching National Geographic and the weekends in my local zoo. This time, I had a rare opportunity to explore a truly untamed and wild continent, all by myself. Welcome to my adventure in Kenya, and welcome to Michael Wonder World. Please hit the like button and subscribe to this channel for more adventures. So today we are going to Lake Bogoria. Uh, we are heading to Lake Bogoria. We're gonna see lots of flamingos. Yeah, lots of flamingos there, and uh, they also have some kind of hot spring, right? Yes, yes, kind of hot spring. And I've seen like videos of people boiling eggs in the hot yeah, spring. Some people boiling eggs, although we didn't bring any eggs. <laughs> it doesn't matter. Because we are not very sure whether the hot spring is still functional. Yeah, there was a flood, right? Yeah, yeah. So. Anyway, we are hoping for the best. National Reserve. There are a lot of goats here and uh, cows. Very interesting to see um, all these domestic animals here and there at the National Reserve. So look around, it's quite green here. Apparently, it used to be drier in this region, um, but nowadays, because of climate change, it rains a lot here. Now we are at the hot spring of Lake uh, Bogoria. This one might be a little bit colder. Mason is trying to find a place to touch the water. <laughs> wow! Oh, it's turning back, the steam. The hot spring was way too hot, so we're leaving. Vincent, <laughs> too hot for you as well? Wow, wow, wow. I'm telling you, that was hard for me. I won't even handle it. Just imagine, it's middle of summer in Africa. We're near the equator around noon, and then there's basically hot water boiling underneath your feet. Yeah, that's hot spring for Gloria. But flamingos love it. There are a lot of flamingos here at uh, Lake Bogoria.
What's your name? My name is Ms. Kidu. Kidu. Nice to meet you. I'm Michael. Yes. And my friend has a machete. There are a lot of goats here in the national park. 